A breach of contract demand letter notifies an individual that he or she has violated the terms of an agreement. The letter is an attempt to settle the breach, documents demands before any legal action is taken against the party in violation. In this video, we'll review significant information about breach of contract demand letters, as well as where to get a free official template. First, let's clear up what is a breach of contract. A breach of contract occurs when one party fails to fulfill a certain obligation that was established and agreed upon in a mutual agreement with another party. It's important for the demanding party to determine which term or clause in the contract was violated and in what way when drafting a demand letter. With that in mind, let's look at some common examples of breaches of contracts. The breaking of a contract can happen in many ways, depending on the terms of the original agreement. Some typical breaches include failure to comply with a payment or repayment schedules deadlines, failure to perform duties of a service in the capacity that it was promised, goods or products not in accordance with what was agreed upon, incomplete work or failure from one party to uphold his or her end of the bargain, and failure to comply with any additional terms and conditions. If a breach does occur, it's also recommended for the demanding party to check the statute of limitations in his or her state to verify if there's a valid case, offering a cure or settlement. A breach of contract demand letter will often demand the violating party to cure or settle the breach. A breach can usually be resolved in the following two ways. Keeping the agreement in effect while correcting contractual problems. For instance, the violating party assuring the other party that he or she will abide by the terms or terminating the agreement and seeking damages for the breach. In the event that the violating party refuses, doesn't comply or respond, seeking legal action would be the appropriate next step. Now let's wrap things up by reviewing what to include in a breach of contract demand letter. The notice should contain the following a header with the contract information of the sender and the recipient, the date when the demand letter was sent, title and effective date of the agreement that was breached, a description of the breach, state whose laws govern the original agreement, a deadline date in which a response is expected, and the signature of the demanding party. When delivering the completed letter, it's recommended to use certified mail to ensure proof of delivery, as to avoid delays and other issues. We're eForms, the largest database of legal documents. Access your free breach of contract demand letter templates at the link below.